uninsured and underinsured motorist coverage. When you're injured in a car accident caused by another driver, you can legally sue the other driver in most states to collect the fair value of your injury. If that driver has auto liability coverage, his policy pays you on his behalf, up to the liability policy limit he purchased. The economic value of your injury equals your out-of-pocket expenses, plus compensation for your pain and suffering. But what if the other driver has no insurance at all? Or what if the insurance limit he has is less than the costs of your injury? You can get a legal judgment against him and try to collect it from him personally. But that can be an expensive, drawn-out process. Plus, if he's not worth very much and has a limited income, you may not collect much at all. Fortunately, your car insurance policy can solve the problem if you buy adequate limits of coverage. Uninsured and underinsured motorist coverages make up the gap between the other driver's liability coverage and the amount of liability coverage he would have needed to pay your claim in full. How do the two coverages work? Say you're injured in a car accident caused by a driver who runs a stop sign. The economic value of your injury is $450,000. Now assume that you bought $500,000 of both uninsured and underinsured motorists' coverage under your auto policy. First, for an underinsured motorist, you collect for your injury from the other driver's insurance in the amount of the other driver's liability limit, say $100,000. Then, you collect the balance of $350,000 from your own insurance company under your underinsured motorist coverage. Had the other driver been without insurance, you would have collected all $450,000 under your uninsured motorist coverage. Find us on Facebook at Insure Your Health Team for more information.